Hey guys, how are you doing? Um, I have an, well it's not unusual, but I haven't gone there that much, but I have a Rite Aid haul to show you just the stuff that I got because my family member got some stuff, but like, you know, tasty cakes and, um, two Milky Ways, the dark ones, so, oh, I can turn off my car now. <laughs> I'm looking at the radio, going to turn the car off. Um, answer me this riddle. How common, it, it's nothing to do with me, it's a friend of mine that's a YouTuber on here. How come people who have no videos, I guess, I guess I'm assuming that you have a channel once, once you uh, sign up, oh Lord help me, um, in my own yard and I'm nervous because this guy is looking like he's drunk or something, um, but anyway, um, I just can't figure it out. You have no videos. You have nothing, you know, just your name and subscribers to nothing. And you can leave somebody a comment that's kind of, um, I guess I would say like a smidge of harsh. So I don't, I don't comprehend that. Um, because I read it and the way that it was written you could so literally have t taken it to where they were being, um, you know, they weren't being, uh, they were being, you know, rude. I could have took it like that in a second. And then, you know, she had came back and then reworded it better. But I don't get that. It's like, you don't know how it is. Of course, I mean, you don't have no videos. So you don't know how... You know, it is for the person who's making the video, you know, what they're going through, how they're feeling, if they're nervous, if they've gone through something that day. You know what I'm saying? I just, I don't know. I don't appreciate it. So I just, and I'm not going to mention her name because, you know, I'm not going to put her on the spot. I mean, my friend, um, but she, if, if she watches my videos and she'll know, but you don't have to comment, dear. I'm not, I'm just, I'm just, I don't get it. You know, it's like people need to watch how they word stuff because... It just ain't cool. I mean, I don't know what the Sam's heck I'm doing. I just hit the button on my phone and and run my mouth and talk to you guys. And I'm not professional in any way, but, you know, I mean, I don't know, y'all. Okay, so we went to, like I said, Rite Aid. Oh, I didn't notice these were different sizes. Now I'm glad I got them. I didn't think I was going to find anything. I wasn't really looking because, like I said, my family went, member went in there and I just went in to... Uh, help, whatever. But I went into the seasonal aisle because I love going into Rite Aid and going to the seasonal aisle. And um, I found these. So they are little heart paper clips. Aren't they so cute? And you have to pay attention to the size because these are like the, not jumbo, but these are like what? Oh God, I thought my phone was moving. Um, I guess the regular size, not you don't know what I'm saying. See how I'm getting all mixed up now. I'm all, I'm all frazzle fried over, over my friend and her um, her drum stuff. Um, I guess they would call these like the jumbo, but now you've got like really, really jumbos in my world. These used to be jumbos cause they never had like them big gigantic ones. And then I found these ones, a frog, a butterfly and a ladybug. So you can kind of see, how can I do this? Let me do it this way. You can kind of see how they're way much bigger. So I didn't even notice that until I'm showing you guys. Because I was like, oh, that has a frog. Okay, grab it. And I just put it in my hand. Okay, I got this. And I'm kind of, this was, I think, the only one. So I really lucked out. I didn't want to pay $3 for it. I think that's probably what we paid. But anyway, it's two-sided compartment box. What does it say? Multi-use organizer. So apparently it's got that side, which you can't see. And then this side. And I will... Surely open it up, and I guess we paid three dollars for it. What's my time? The other two things I have to show you are basically the same thing, but I have um I forgot what I what I wanted to get this for. I have um apparently have gotten like some charms that I that I got for like um if I ever made you know one of those whoops there y'all go one of them like junk journals or just your journal and. In general, I got some beads and I can't get this thing off. I need to stop. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this is where the sticker was. 
And then, wait a minute, where am I at? <laughs> and then when you open the door, this is what you got. So these apparently are not removable trays. So the space, I mean, it is, it doesn't look as deep, but it is pretty nice and deep. So that's nice. Now these ones up here are not really deep, but I don't need to use all of them. And then this side, I can't tell if you guys are moving or not. And I didn't even have lunch, y'all. It's going on 425. And um, I left the house probably like way after one o'clock, went to the grocery store. And then Rite Aid was right next to Graws. So we went there and um, I came out in the car. I'm like, let me get this done. This is nice if there's like a pencil or something I want to put in here. Or like maybe some pliers. You know, those um, like needle nose pliers. And then you've got these little compartments. So I thought that was cool. And I like it that it's nice and, you know, I mean, it's that's how um, wide it is. I need to put Velcro or something. That's what I should do, Velcro or something. I'll make up my own thing for my phone. But anyway, this is what it is if you guys want to find it at your um, Rite Aid. I guess, four, I mean, $3 isn't bad. And then I found this and then I put it back and I'm like, you know what, for this size, I'm going to get it. This is what I have two of. And if you don't believe me, I'll show you the other one. So here they are. And they were $3 as well. It is a nine drawer. I thought it was just precious because, but I, you know, I didn't want to pay this. I didn't want to pay the price, but apparently I did. Um, well, my family member got them, got these for me. She's like, what are you going to do with them? You got to put them on the ceiling. I said, put them on the ceiling. I don't know what she thought they were. Um, organized and store nuts, bolts, nails, small household items, craft supplies, and more. Drawers are made from clear. Yeah. Hello, Kim. Drawers are made from a clear and strong durable plastic suitable for home workshop or office sizes six and three fourths times three and one half and four and one fourth and contents not included. Isn't that so dumb? They have to say that right there. You don't get all that good stuff. Now, I wouldn't even know. What to do. Oh, I couldn't catch you. You guys just want to look at this. Um, Look at the clouds. That's all you're trying to do. So look, this is what it looks like. Isn't this precious? And all the little drawers, of course, they open. Oh, that's nice. They also have to wear, I guess, if it's old. <laughs> well, guess what? Oh, there you guys go again. So apparently, we don't have it. I, see, aren't, aren't y'all glad I can't edit? I don't know where they all went. But um, aren't you guys glad that I can't edit this? Didn't I? I might have just said that. Uh-oh. Okay, hold on, guys. Okay, y'all. I'm already at eight minutes, but <laughs> I can't find two of them. Okay, I see one. Hold on. I don't want to step on it. I don't know where the other one went. Oh, I feel it. How are you guys? You'll see. Look at... Oh, my Lord have mercy. Woo! Look at that gray hair. Eric says white. That's pathetic. 41 years old looking around like a witch. I would scare myself. Anyway, I found all the drawers now. So I was, I did that because not like I, I didn't know they were all going to pop out. But when I pulled this one out and see how it has, the, <laughs> it has that like grab on it. So I guess for a couple seconds, now you don't, why are you not going back in there? Okay, I'm, I'm on, I must be on candy camera. I'm not on YouTube no more. But see, it had that little where, you know, for a second it's not going to come out. But when you tip it all over, it will come out. But so for that little bit of second, you know, it's going to, let me do it that way. See, that's why I thought I could dump it like that. And it, but anyway, so I got two of those. Whoops, no, I'm not going to do it again. One laugh. One laugh per video, and then you've got the little notches that you guys can hang it. So, that be what that be. Um, and then, not like you guys know, but I'm just going to go ahead and put this out there. I did have to delete one of my videos. Um, I mean, you guys didn't get a chance to see it, but I, had, I spazzed out. I was in uh, the Dollar Tree parking lot. Not the one that Eric was with me at. Um... It was like the, the big one. And I don't know if I've showed you that 
that like Dollar Tree on the outside. I think I've taken you guys inside of it before, but um, anywho, like a lot of people were just coming near me and I tried to do a video one time in the mall parking lot and this, this young people had pulled up and I think I told you guys in the video that this, and then when I turned to go look, cause I was showing a shirt or something and all of a sudden I go to look over and the girl's like kind of near the glass going, and I'm like, so I, I, I'm, I'm, I get weirded out. I haven't got to that point, but anyway, so I ordered this. It's so funny. My church is called his way. Well, this Christian bookstore is called his way. So it's so funny that the church is his way. My, I mean, my church is his way and this bookstore that I order this from is his way. But, um, Blanca, I guess that's how you say her name. B-L-A-N-C-A. Isn't she beautiful? And these are all the songs. Well, let me read them to you because they're kind of going the opposite direction. Um, and her CD, I, I think it's just called Blanca. I think that's what they told me. Um, it's different drum. Who am I? Which I love that song. Who am I? If you say go, get up, surrender, echo, catching fire, sunshine, not backing down is a kicktail song. That's an awesome song. Also forever love worry. Greater is he today and chosen ones. Now, if you guys want to cry, if you're a crier like I am, go on, get on here on YouTube and put in, um, greater is he, greater is he, and there's a little boy in the video. I'm pretty sure it starts off with him and his mother is his, in the video, his mother is sick and bless his little heart. Um, I, I hope I don't cry talking about it, but he like just, he has to deal with bullies in the video. Um, he does everything in the world that he can. Okay, Kim, stop it to help his mother. And at the, near the end, the, I don't know if the lady is a, she's an older lady, like a senior citizen. And she, she sees the little boy, you know, like he cuts grass. He does all this because the, the, there's a man that came. Oh, I'm getting chills. There's a man that, that basically had, has given him a notice that, you know, they're going to lose their house. Um, or whatever, you know, whatever you want to call it. And, um, so he is, he's busting his tail, busting his tail. The video is beautiful. Oh my gosh. And that little boy and bless his mother. Oh my goodness. And, um, but strong faith, strong faith got him through because, um, he busted his tail and he went to that door and he even took the last end of the video. He took his bicycle that helped him do all this and he put it in the pawn shop. And, um, and the lady must have either saw or knew or whatever. I, if I cry guys, I'm sorry. I got the tears coming up. It is just, I've never talked about the video, but I didn't know it was still going to make me cry. Uh, every time I watch it, I tear up. I can't watch it anymore. Um, but anyway, so the lady goes and gets his bike and puts it on the porch and that's how it ends. And it is that song. It is just a beautiful, beautiful song. My favorite songs though, I'll tell you again, my favorite songs are who am I? Not backing down and greater is he. Awesome, awesome songs. A lot of her other songs are awesome, but those three, but that little boy helping his mom like that and just, you know, at the end, I mean, not, I guess a kind of in like in the middle of the video, he like jumps over, like, I guess they were kind of like just two boys just standing there, you know, and you could tell that they were, you could tell that they were bullies, but anyway, um, so I'm going to go. I did not mean this to be 15 or close to 15 minutes, but me running my mouth. But, um, anyway, I just think, you know, like a lot of, like a lot of YouTubers say, you know, we got to be kind of one another. We're, we're doing the same thing. You know, we're some of us, some of y'all are lucky to get paid to do this stuff. Some, I mean, some of us aren't, um, and then some of us aren't even making videos, but we're, we're all, you know, in the same, you know, punch bowl, you know what I'm saying? We might be different flavors, but we're all in the same punch bowl. Um, or we're all the same, you know, like cereal, you know, we're, we're all the same. We're just different boxes, you know, different cereal and different boxes, but we're all, you know, trying to do the same thing. You know what I'm saying? So instead of like bashing and stuff, you know, we need to come together and 
and and be kinder in, in words that you know that we choose to write and all that like if i can't stand something like people that keep nitpicking their hair and stuff uh, do i say anything no i don't leave a comment <laughs> oh but that's annoying though <laughs> Anyway, guys, I'm going to go before I get myself in trouble. I'll talk to you guys later. Today's Thursday. Have a blessed one. Bye, guys.